Hello, this is David Benign from Excel Consulting. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create these cool charts that are basically stacked infographics in Excel and PowerPoint. I'm just going to remind you before we get started to click on that subscribe button. There are plenty more videos like this in Excel, PowerPoint, how to videos, Power BI, even some Outlook and Word ones as well. So let's get going. So here you have your data. And what you're going to do is you're going to insert a column chart. Works the same with a horizontal bar chart, but what, let's get going with this one for now. Okay, so we're going to first delete the stuff we're not going to use, like these grid lines and these uh, access to declutter the chart. Then we're going to go to the insert tab and we're going to go to icons and illustrations. And this is only available in PowerPoint and Excel 2019 or more recent. And it allows you to use these icons uh, that are pre-built by designers. And they have special powers, as we'll see. So what these can do that others can't is that you can completely change the color to anything that you want. Like that. This one can be yellow. This one can be green. It, any way you want, you can change the outline. The software treats them like shapes, so you can do pretty much anything that you want with them like you can with shapes. So I'm going to, now I'm going to right click and copy that, and then I'm gonna click here, click twice, and press Control V to paste it. Uh, I'm gonna do the same with ships, Control C. Don't double click it, because that will open this up. That's not what you want. What you want is to slowly click twice. Control C once, twice, Control V. And there we go. Last step that we need to do, click on this icon, then go to stack and scale with. And the one is fine. You can change that one if you want, but that gets us the look we're looking for. So that's perfect. All right, and that's pretty much it. You can delete this if you don't want it to repeat it. And you can do the same in PowerPoint as in Excel. So final thing I want to show you is if you want some icons that are not in the 850 that are in that menu, you can go to this website called The Noun Project. I like this one um, because you get a lot of choice. I personally have a subscription to it, but you can do stuff without a subscription to it. If you download an SVG, this one, then this is anything that you can choose. And if you use PowerPoint, you can drag it in. Excel, you can kind of import it using your import features. And it works the same way as I just showed you. You can change all the colors and anything you want, copy and paste it into charts as you wish. So if you like this video, please like the video and also subscribe to my channel. I have more infographics videos as well. So please have a look at those and we will keep going. Thanks for watching.